All right, Flo, man, we saw it. People were raving about him. I've heard a lot of good things. Javon Kinlaw on the inside. He's stuffing the run. Um, he's getting there. He really, last year, remember, he didn't participate in practices, like different drills. He's the first one there. He's running. He's sprinting. What do you think about this man? It's his last year's contract, so you know that he's going to be motivated. Um, and he's going to be playing backup, so he's going to be coming in the games fresh. What do you think, man? Any chance that he comes up and steps up this year, man? Nah, man, I ain't buying this. I bought no. this same same story last year. Hmm. They're saying he looked great and everything. I understand it's gonna be at a lesser role coming off the bench, but even then, like I understand depth's important, but I just can't trust this guy anymore, man. I I believed for so long, and last year he just let me down, and that was it. I I, I gave him it was like the baseball edge. I gave him the three strikes. He's out for me. Well, what do you think, man? You know what, man? Um. Right now, I'm not I'm not going crazy because I know some of these beat reporters are like, oh, man, he's looking really good. I'm not saying anything because there's no freaking pads right now. They can't hold on to anything. These offensive linemen, they're on an island. If he does starts doing this on Monday, then I'll be like, okay, maybe we might have something here. But as of right now, I'm not going to go all crazy. It could happen just because I know we got Hargrave and Armstead both starting. And, I mean, he's going to be coming in fresh. So this, if there's any time that Javon Kinlaw is going to have a – good year i don't even say great because it's not gonna happen he's gonna have a good year it's gonna be this year because he's gonna be fresh off the bench um they everyone's saying that he's in the best shape of his life i know we heard that last year but john kyle shanahan is like preaching it this is the best we've ever seen him so uh, i'm gonna wait to see what happens and then preseason if he steps up then i'll get a little excited but as of right now no pads, man. So I can't get too crazy right now. Go ahead. Yeah, that's going to be the pretty much the big thing is the preseason. Because remember, Javon Kinlaw last year, he looked good in those camps. But mm -hmm. once we got to that Minnesota preseason game, I know you said early he on he, sack, he yeah. had that sack. But then after that, I thought he just got pushed back. After, from that point on, yeah. he was just getting pushed back all year long. So I'm not riding with that. I, yeah. I hope he does good just because I know he's bounced back from injuries. But... I just can't trust them anymore. Yeah, the one thing I'll say is that when people are on their last year of their contracts, look at Eric Armstead, man. This guy, he looked like he was like going down the drain. It was it for him. And all of a sudden, contract year, what happens? Ten sacks. So maybe he might be that motivated where he's just been like healthy finally and like I got it all going together and I want to get paid next year. I want to be in the NFL next year, you know? So that's one thing that I think maybe there's a chance. I'm not buying it, but I think there's that chance, man, so. I don't know, man. It should be interesting to see what happens. All right. Well, you guys left some comments. What do you guys think about Javon Kinlaw? Is he gold or fool's gold? Like, comment, subscribe. Mm -hmm. Hit that notification bell. See you all next time. Peace. Peace.